Hey everyone, Isaac Noble here. Today I wanted to talk about one very critical element of muscle physiology that we haven't gotten to talk about yet, and that's called the stretch reflex. Now in a stretch reflex, a muscle or group of muscles will involuntarily contract in response to a stretching sensation. Now in human skeletal muscle, there's something called muscle spindles that are built in to sense a stretch. Now if that stretch is forceful enough, they will send a signal to our spinal cord and right back out towards the muscles, which is called the spinal reflex, and they will trigger those muscles to contract, which is why it's called a reflex or a stretch reflex. Now it's important to understand that reflexes are often stronger than conscious activation of muscle because these reflexes are meant to protect the human body. Now, the application of this principle to the arm swing is extremely important if you want to maximize your arm speed. Now, the reason why the arm swing is so counterintuitive is because we're trying to elicit something that's involuntary. We're trying to elicit a reflex in our internal rotators the muscles that stretch and load to catapult this limb forward. So all of the energy and all of the movement that we generate at our torso, which is really the engine of the human body, is meant to help our arm go further and faster back into external rotation, which allows those internal rotators to stretch quicker and to elicit that very strong involuntary stretch reflex. So again, instead of trying to force this limb forward, if you feel those muscle activations happening on the front of the shoulder, you know you're doing it wrong. The idea is to throw this arm back as fast as you can while simultaneously rotating the torso forward. And again, that's how you activate that stretch reflex. Again, my name is Isaac Newble. I hope you enjoyed the video and there's more on the way.